Y'all, so let's start with the big stuff first. I purchased this Kellogg's Ego Homestyle Waffles right here. You get 60 in a pack. I thought this was a really great uh, deal. All right, y'all. So next, I purchased this 20 um, pouch value pack right here of Little Bites, and it's the birthday cake ones. I thought it was a very good value. Um, I pretty much stopped purchasing them from Walmart. Like every blue moon, I might purchase some, but I usually get them from Dollar Tree when they come through with the Intermins. Um, for a dollar twenty-five cent, you can't beat it. Okay, so I went ahead and got the value pack right there. And then I picked up the chicken and cheese quesadillas. We love these. These are really, really good, you all. You get 12. All right. All right. So next I picked up the seasoned fully cooked grilled chicken bites right here. Three pounds. Now, I'll never get these. I found these in there. I want to say I remember them from a long time ago. But I never did purchase them. So I went ahead and purchased them this time because they can be good for salads. Um, and I eat a lot of salads from time to time. And I could put those in there. Or, you know, your lunch when well, you don't want to do these ones right here. I got the breaded ones too. And they taste like uh, they got a little bit of dill in them. And they taste like the ones from Chick-fil-A. So, you got the grilled ones from Chick-fil-A. And you got the breaded ones from Chick-fil-A. They taste just like Chick-fil-A, you all. So, I got those. And then I picked up the waffle fries right here. So, what? Chick-fil-A all day long? <laughs> I absolutely love it. We enjoy this. And we usually get the chicken sandwiches um as well but considering we just finished up the last ones uh last night i didn't buy any more i just got the um the little uh bites and things so that's what i got right there and then i picked up two packs of the lamb chops these are the ones that i like to buy i can't do the stick y'all i i just can't okay i've been to the restaurants that does the stick I just don't like them on the stick. Okay, I like these better. These are this is this is my thing right here. So I got two packs of those, and then I picked up some Kit Kat um, cones right here. You get sixteen. These were on sale for seven dollars and eighty eight cents. Shut up! Awesome deal. So you get wafer with fudge and chocolate wafer. So I was um. I was happy about that. And they did have some more. They had the Nutty Buddy um, drumsticks. I think it was 16 They were fairly cheap as well. I said, girl, if y'all going over there and get this. Yes. So I got those. And then the only other thing that I got from Sam's Club is like a big thing of twist drinks. Um, says sugar free. We had them last time. They're so, so good. I couldn't find the Welch's. They didn't have any Welch's in stock or they moved them or something. I went down that line twice and I didn't see any. So yeah, so that's my Sam's haul. So let me put this up and then I'm going to show you, uh, what else I got. So you all, this is no particular order because I have been to all these Ingles, Food Line, Sam's Club, Walmart. So yeah, these right here are so, so good. It's the seafood boil in the bag. And I purchased them last year. And I don't know if y'all remember, but I was on the hunt for them in one of my videos. And I was looking for them, but they hadn't put them out yet. So they put them out this time. And I made sure I got two of them. These are so, so daggum good. You get shrimp, corn on the cob, mussels, red skin potatoes, um, and do sausage, Cajun style seasoning packet, and you can always add something else to it to your liking. But they are nice, um, the way they are, in my opinion. Really, really good. And they give you a lot. Okay, let me see. Um, the last time I had them, I know I was able to get, let me see what the service is. Serving says six, and that's that's about right. You get six servings out of here. Really, really good deal you are. And it was like, what, $10, I want to say? So I got those. And then I just picked up some pizza as well. Sometimes I get the ones um, that's not the thin crust. I get the other ones. But I wanted the thin crust this time. Uh, sausage pizza, cheese pizza, 
Meat Lovers Pizza and Supreme Pizza right there. And this is for like um, lunches or um, movie night, pizza night, whatever. All the time I don't feel like going and getting no pizza from the restaurant. So, I got some on hand, okay? Now, from Ingles, I got these um, ribs right here. This is not my typical ribs that I usually get. I usually get uh, baby back ribs. But, this is what was chosen. So, you know, went ahead and got those. And then, picked up some fresh ground turkey. I want to say I got this from um, Aldi. I want to say. But if I didn't, it came from, uh, yeah, I want to say I got it from Aldi. If I didn't, I can't remember where it came from, okay? <laughs> but I picked up some of that right there. And then back over here at Ingles, I picked up two packs of turkey necks right here. And then... I also picked, they didn't, okay, so the stores that I went to, they didn't have a good variety of, of, um, uh, meat, and I just don't be picking up anything, I, I just can't put anything into my system if it don't look right, so, look, look at this little tiny thing of, um, cube steak, look at this, so I ended up having to get the little tiny ones, because the big ones, one, was too much, and two, they didn't look good for the price that they was asking, so, this was $2.72. You get three in there. And then I also picked up some of these little um, uh, sliders. Okay. And here is another pack of the cube steak. <clears throat> another pack right there. And then I picked up a big thing of uh, beef stew right here. Okay, so that is, I want to say that's the meats. I might have some more things somewhere else, but I want to say that's the meats that I got because, like I said, the meats were not looking too good. And for the price that they be asking, my meat is going to have to look exceptionally well. I'm not going to pay $16 and $13 in the meat looking like it's been sitting there for about 12 months. Like a whole year. Okay, I'm not going to do it. I, I'm not going to do it. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. So, that's what I got there. So, now we got the drinks. The drinks were three for five at Food Line. So, I picked up an RC, a Sun Drop, and a grape right there. Good deal. And from Walmart, I picked up the Milo's Sweet Tea and Lemonade. I picked up the Tropical Punch. And I picked up the Berry Punch. And I'm trying not to get the cartons anymore. But, you know, when you got an extra person with you. <laughs> so, I ended up getting two of the cartons. Okay. And I'm just going to sit them in like a little dish. Because they do start to leak. And so, yeah, I'm going to sit them in a dish. A little dish. So, if they do leak, they won't mess up the refrigerator. And... I picked up some vanilla iced coffee from Food Line. They had a sale. It was two for five. So I picked up watermelon and lemonade right there. And then from Aldi's, I picked up some orange juice. I got two of those. I told you I'd be all over. I picked up two of those right there. And then from, where I get this from? Food line on Walmart, one of the two. I picked up the Fair Life. I love this milk right here. I it used to be almond milk and um oat milk, but I changed over to the Fair Life. I think this tastes a little bit better and I like it. And so I try and buy it. Now it is pricey, but I try and buy it um when I can get it. So I got that. Okay, so next, picked up some bananas. I got some mini cucumbers. Got some watermelon. Got some apples. Chopped them up. Put them in school lunches. And I got some steakums right here. Food Line had a sale on the Pop-Tarts, two for five. Picked up some Uncrustables. Y'all know I can't stand it. <laughs> and then I picked up um, just some uh, beef New York strip steaks right here. Um, again, I wanted something different, but this is the only things that they had that was, um, reasonable 
in my opinion, because everything else was high as piss and I, I, I wasn't doing it. And so I got four um, for state dinner night, whenever that's going to be, child, with a baked potato, some broccoli or something. So I got that. All right. From Walmart. I know I probably wasn't telling y'all just a minute ago. Child, it was too much going on. But anywho, I got these um, cheese sticks right there. Picked up some mozzarella sticks. I got some uh, sliced plain French bread. They had these um, splash waters on clearance. I think they was like $2 and something. So I picked up lemon. And then I got mandarin orange. And I got wild berry. And of course you all see the Chobani flips. So I got strawberry. Um, let's see. I got two strawberry cheesecakes. And I got two of the cookies and cream. And then I got two of the coconut caramel cookies. And then I got some chicken salad right there. And then I got the 15 count of Sam's Purified Water right there. Alright, so I picked up an 18 box of um, chips right here. I got some Star Crunch. I got some Swiss Rolls right there. I got some fudge rounds, some oatmeal cakes, some honey buns, some chewy chocolate chip cookies right there, some strawberry shortcake rolls, and some zebra cakes. All right, you all. So I picked up a good bit of canned vegetables as well. Green beans, sweet peas, and corn. I picked up two things of corned beef hash right here. Picked up some manwich and some diced tomatoes right there. I picked up some um, mashed potatoes, garlic, roasted garlic, four cheese, buttery. I picked up the macaroni and cheese smoked gouda and white cheddar black and pepper these came from aldi picked up two boxes of cornbread picked up two things of the banana muffins from aldi picked up a big thing of the cheese it's you get 12 and i picked up a little box meal right here creamy cheesy chicken alfredo and then I picked up two boxes of these from Aldi's. I also picked up some chocolate Yoohoo and strawberry Yoohoo. And I think that might be it. Mm -hmm. These are really good, you all. All right, y'all. I'll see you momentarily. All right, y'all. So I made it to Marshall's. And I'm looking at some of their purses because it was two that I had seen while I was on my trip that I wanted but I'm not finding them this right here is 30 I don't too much care for that and they got the little Steve Madden right there for 30 nothing over here is piquing my interest it's 24 I want what I seen let me go around here's the other corner I did like this I did like that. But they want a hundred dollars for that. Oh, they got it. They got it. They got it, y'all. This was the one I wanted. It might have been in a uh, paint up, but I wanted this. I really wanted this. And I said, well, I'm going to wait and see if ours get it. And they got it. <sighs> Lord have mercy. I don't know, y'all. <laughs> I don't know, but I really like that style. This is cute, too. And it's less expensive. It's $25. A little bit more uh, practical. And on a budget. I like this, too. Right here. It's kind of cute. Man, girl, it's only uh, it's red tag for sixteen dollars. Look at there. Hmm. This one right here, red tag for uh, eighteen. Look at there. Hmm. That's kind of cute too. 
this one right here, look, it was 50. Then they red tagged it for 40. Then they red tagged it for 20. That might be the option. And it's roomy. Mm. This is red tag for 22 right here. I see so many people talking about these um, perfumes right here. Oh, is this the cocoa? All right. Ooh, I seen um, a short, a reel, or something about this right here. I'm about to smell this. This is cocoa cloud. Let me see what it smells like. It smells good. It smells just like coconut. This one right here. This smells really good. It's uh, $17. This smells absolutely divine, you all. Y'all see that? I want to love this. I like it, but I don't like it. But I like it. It smells, it smells good. I'm on the fence about this. This smells nice, too. Cashmere and vanilla. I had to put that one on, child. That smells, that smells good. It's a, it's a tad bit, a, a tad bit loud. Okay, but it smells really good. All right, y'all, so I'm back home. So let me show you all what I got. So I picked up the little damp duster right here. I got one and two. I've been wanting them for a minute, so I got those. And, y'all, they got me at the register, okay? They got me at the register. Look what they had. Some daggum Girl Scout Coconut Caramel Bites. They also had the Thin Mint Bites. Y'all, I wasn't ready. <laughs> and I was looking to see if they had any more, too. Look, Team Greedy. But, yeah, they had these up there at the register, y'all. So, I gave in and I purchased them. And they were... Five dollars. My goodness. The next thing I picked up was my purse right here. I decided to go with this since I first initially wanted this when I was on my trip. And I said, you know what? You better go on and get that because you had your heart set on it and you wanted it. You went in there for it. Go on and get it. And so I went ahead and got it, y'all. I absolutely love it. It's really cute and I love the way it feels. Really nice. And then, let me sit down. The next thing I picked up, I got some perfume. Y'all, I would turn the camera around, but I'm going through my allergies. My eyes is red and watery, and it's, I'm a mess right now. <laughs> so, yeah. So, I picked up some perfume. I got this right here because it was really pretty. The bottle was nice. Had this little ribbon on there. Little top. And this was a uh, Jean Mark Paris. It says, I love you. And it's sugar. Now, I sprayed this on when I was standing in line as well. And then I couldn't find the scent anymore. So, I'm hoping that it doesn't um, disappear quickly. I'm, I'm hoping that's what it is. But I picked it up. I thought it was a real good price i usually don't mess with the perfumes that's on the shelf i usually go in there for the higher end ones that's locked up but i said let me go ahead and start you know seeing what the ones on the shelf about so i got that one and then i picked up this one right here the cocoa cloud right here it smells really good you all and i can still smell uh this scent on me and you can smell it through the um well, this one you can smell through the uh, bottle top. And I want to say, I don't know, the one with the cashmere. What was it? Cashmere, amber, amber, cashmere. That smelled good as well. It's still on my hand. So, let me spray this and let me see. Yes, this smells so damn good, y'all. Yes. Let me try this other one again right here. This one does smell really good. It smells so good. Oh, my gosh. I sprayed it in a different spot. Oh, my God, it smells so good. So, I highly suggest next time you're in Marshalls and you see the sugar and the um, cocoa cloud right there for you all to smell them and see if you like them.